On the cultural front today, we take time to learn about a Korean work of craft that travels back centuries. My colleague Kim jong shil has more on the art of Hwamun Sok. Do take a look. Red, yellow, orange, blue. There isn't an image or color that Hwamun Sok can't recreate on its plant canvas. Mainly used as a carpet or a mat, Hwamun Sok is a South Korean traditional rush weaving handicraft that dates back 1600 years. The word Hwamun Sok means flower patterned mat and refers to both the craft as well as the piece that is created. It's made with the dried stems of a plant. But not just any plant, it needs wangol. Wangol is a type of plant that looks a lot like a rice plant but is more durable to external forces. Here on Kangwado Island is a Hwamunsuk workshop that's been maintaining this tradition for decades. The owner of the workshop, Park Yun-hwan, tells us why he wanted to run this place. It was my dream to share South Korea's wonderful culture with people abroad. I wanted them to know about one of South Korea's traditions. Just 10 minutes from the workshop is a paddy field where they grow wangol. Following the harvest in early August, the wangol is dried and color dyed to make it into hwamun sok. And thanks to its sturdy nature, hwamun sok, once completed, can last for up to 30 years. However, there are fears for the future of the craft. The number of hwamun sok craftspeople in the country is declining, and wangol is not an easy plant to grow. People in South Korea don't really know about Hwamun Sok, but it's a good part of our culture. It has its values and it's beautiful. Its patterns represent history too. Just like any high-end luxury product, it takes hundreds of hours of meticulous work and dedication to make one Hwamun Sok. One craftsperson at the workshop, who has more than 50 years of experience, says she can make only one mat per month. So in order to stop the culture from disappearing, the workshop hosts hands-on programs for students to experience making the traditional mat. I didn't know this is how Hwamun Seok is made. It's so fascinating. It's good that children can learn about Hwamun Seok and its creation. I think children will feel proud of their hometown. For now, work will continue to preserve the cultural legacy of South Korea's historic rush-weaving handicraft. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.